always, my greatest successes are followed by the greatest failures. Wendell Tully, husband, father, scientist. He succeeded only in the end. My greatest regret. If only there was something I could do to reverse time. Some sort of time machine. Oh, no. Buddy, if you, you don't... I, I feel like you need other more rational scientists around you to temper his just general insanity. Yeah, yeah. The science seems quite clear it would be impossible, and yet I never thought that covalent spacing reduction could be a reality either. If, if, if the raw science could be applied in the way of the time struck, no, no, that the, the time space continue. Oh, if, if one found. <laughs> <laughs> it mumbles incoherently about raw science on the space time continuum. But I digress. It, yeah, huh? You see, even if I went home now, my family wouldn't recognize me. Trudy would not see the man she buried. My children would be repulsed by the bag of skin that speaks with the voice of their father. Home. Oh, yes, yes, of course. Home. Your parents must be worried. So very worried. The process is not difficult. You will simply need to brew an embiggening cocktail at the Javamatic machine. Ah, oh, you are wise. You are wise. Wise beyond your years. Yes, indeed. There is a secret ingredient. The embiggening process is extremely taxing on living subjects. You'll need enough nutrients and proteins to survive the expansion to your original size. We use the embiggening cell to regulate this expansion by way of the secret cocktail. The ingredients in the cocktail, like the keratin in toenails, uh. fortify the skeletal structure as it grows. Oh, oh, mm. No, no, that's no. Unfortunately, there is this small issue of over expansion. <laughs> oh, no. If the subject grows too quickly, they are prone to overexpansion, or in layman's terms, they explode. <laughs> to counter this, sustained infusions of carbon dioxide gas must be added to the mixture. Fortunately, I found a secret ingredient that works perfectly in this regard. Grilled science. Grilled science? Yeah, it's the... Uh, what? Grilled science! Raw science represents the essence of ingenuity, but thrown over the coals of fire, it is tempered by flame, tamed by Burgle's spatula, and emerges as something greater. Plump and juicy. Weird. Grilled science! <laughs> of course. It reminds me of the barbecues we once had in our backyard. Oh, Trudy, Sarah, Thor. The last of the grilled science is in the refrigerated storage room over there. Okay. I'm going to go and assume that this is grilled science. <laughs> it, is, it is science in the shape of a hamburger patty that is cooked and steaming. Of course it is. Of course. Wow, there's a lot of, a lot of food in here. Are you ready to go? 
We'll need some grilled science. Good. Good. Then we have everything we need to proceed. I promise I will get you home. I may have failed my own children, but I will not fail you. Let's let's not get ahead of ourselves. You have plenty of time to fail me, bud. Uh, yeah, I'll be nice. Oh, from the mouths of babes. Yes, you may be right. It might not be too late for me. But what is most important is getting you home. We need to head to the Javamatic machine in the upper yard. There we can blend the embiggening cocktail needed to run the spacer safely. I'm opening the back door for you. I will follow close. Oh. Are you sure you're gonna follow me? He's gonna follow me. Oh boy. My guy's picture is just this shriveled dude with a mustache and glasses. Oh, huh. That's oh. interesting. Oh, here. What's interesting? What's on your mind? Oh, boy. He straight up has, like, conversation shit now. Is he going to just... Where, where is he? Oh, there you are. Okay, so he, we, he wants me to go over there. I wonder if he'll say anything if I bring him to my base that's nearby. Mm. And I need two moss. I'm not getting that here. Maybe if I bring him there, then he'll stay there, and then I go about my business doing stuff. One would hope. <laughs> Where is he? Oh, he's just sitting there. Didn't want to build like a little ray gun into that thing or something. And I guess his like lower skeleton had to have shrunk. Ah, fire ants are assholes. Everything looks good from here. Really? Every everything? Okay. I could say so. I forgot how I got up there last time. I crawled up a giant spark wire or some such. Ow. Stupid blade hits. What's on your mind? What do you want to know? Pride? Hubris? The desire to change the world? Eventually, I could not turn back. No matter what it cost. Those tiny hands again. Look on my yard work, ye mighty, and despair. The curse of covalent spacing reduction. My curse I must if there is no cure then I am surely doomed so do I think it can be cured it must be fair enough oh sorry Wendell you did run in front of the savvies Oh, well, it's a good thing I got a bomb. This guy'd be falling around for freaking ever.
The embiggening cell is in place. We're almost ready to commence brewing. Invalid 259 game quests? What? Wait, what, what did he say to do? I have to go up there. I wonder if he's going to keep following me around forever. Even after I get this all set up and I don't, because I, I haven't made the juice. Oh. I have to place everything into here. Yeah. Oh no, how am I supposed to get all oh, right, this is a zip line, right? Is there a zip line? Or am I supposed to just launch myself off of here now? <laughs> uh do I have one of those things? I do not. Oh good. Well, I guess I got this guy that's following me around now because I uh was not intending to ouch finish this just yet. I don't have the stuff on me for it anyways. Ooh, there it is. Dramatic. Okay, we're looking for... I think it's called like super... Oh, yeah, it's a stuff right here. Super. That's the only one up right now. Because I have killed all of the other Black Widows. Eat them. Consume them. I have limits. I'm holding the button down. I guess I thought I did. That's what I write this. Everything looks good from here. Does it? It looks like a bunch of murder bugs to me. It's so weird that it keeps doing that. It's obviously I'm trying to go that direction. I'm not looking the other way, you know? Squeak indeed, little buddy. Squeak indeed. The Black Widow descends. <laughs> Did he just scream? I forgot to set my waypoint, but I'm not gonna need it. <laughs> I will sprint like a motherfucker if I get low. Hey, don't get in my way, you little freaking raisin in a jar. Fighting for my life here. I mean, I'm technically fighting for poison because I want to make a dagger, but also my life. Why the fuck? Oh. There we go. I didn't have my heels on. I was like, what is going on? I should be hearing. Like that. I'm full heal. Ha ha. I'm at Wendell. Get in the way as much as you fail at science. Oh, where to go? Where is it? Oh, huh. That's interesting. What, the giant spider trying to kill me? Yes, you get in the way, less so. Oh, good. Only one more venom. 
boy, what, where is my goddamn spur? Thank you. Oh, Blagle. Blagle. I heard the word raisining. Raisining is an advanced form of dehydration and an unfortunate side effect of the shrinking process on humans. It appears to become worse with each subsequent use of the spacer. Even without prolonged use, it is a degenerative malady that has no cure at this moment. At the time of his disappearance, Dr. Tully himself was keenly experiencing the side effects of raisining and was actively working on a solution. That research is currently on hold. Good news I for you, however. Ocular analysis right indicates a now. normal number of folds on your face for a human of your age. A normal number of folds. Well, thanks, bud. Thing. Oh, I haven't talked about this one yet. Director Schumacher, the head of the science division, oversaw Dr. Tully's projects at Ominent. Dr. Tully's disdain for Director Schmechter was even more than his disdain for soggy french fries. Oh, soggy french fries are pretty bad. So that's, oh, yeah, fuck Schmechter then. If he's worse than soggy french fries, <laughs> oh, yeah. He's definitely evil. They had many disagreements over the years over the direction of the science division. If Schmechter is involved with this, I can assure you he is up to no good. I mean, he's kidnapping children. So, uh, no shit. <laughs> That's what Dr. Tully would say. I have never met the chap and so must reserve judgment. That's very science of you. How but also you kidnapping today? children. So, you know, fuck it. Uh, goodbye, I will see you. What's on your mind? So, the man's. I'll need to process that. <laughs> I'm not going to talk to you uh, around Burgle because Burgle's going to just keep blah, 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 blah. And I don't want to deal with that. He's, he's just a noisy person, which which is fine. It's fine. It's, it's fine. It's just uh, a second trying to do other stuff.